Hi there, Delinda back, and today's little ditty is about, do you ever get nervous when you're going someplace for the first time? You know, I'll tell you, one of the things I know people get really nervous about is when they go visit a church for the first time. And if you're single and walking in by yourself, it's even more scary. So how can you handle that? If you're going to church for the first time or a business meeting or the PTA, when you're going someplace for the first time, how can you handle that so you don't feel so nervous and have that pit in your stomach? My easy answer for you is this. Take your eyes off yourself and look at the other people. That's right. Now, my daughter had a lot of that anxiety when she was in high school, and this seemed to work pretty well for her. It took some practice, and so if you're in that case, let me just assure you that when you practice it a few times, it gets easier. So the best thing to do is, first of all, put a smile on your face, stand up tall, don't walk in looking at your phone and looking at your keys and you know your head down. You want to look inviting and friendly because that's the kind of person you want to meet, right? All right, so you hold your head up, you smile. And the first thing I do is I look around the room and look for a smiling face. So when I see somebody, I'll just walk right up to that person and then I just ask them a very non-threatening question and it's about them and not about me. I don't say, hi, this is Delinda, yada, yada. It's like, oh, hi there. You have the most beautiful hair. I just love it. It's just so attractive. That's one way. Or you could say, oh, it is such a beautiful day. Do you like this season of the year? Or what season do you like best? Could even be something like, oh, this is my first time here. Have you been going here long? It takes that pressure off of you so they're not looking at you and you don't feel intimidated and puts it on them to answer a question. Normally they'll say, oh yeah, I love it. It's beautiful outside. And then you can go into the other conversation and say your name and all of those kind of things. So again, the biggest tip I can give you for going into an event where you don't know anybody is to just walk in, be confident, smile, and just put your emphasis on them and not on you. 